Alrighty, so... What was I going to say? Oh yeah, buddy of mine wanted me to redo, well not redo, but necessarily, but to talk about uh, farming units. Um, and so I did a video about it using Thor a little while, a while back, but it didn't have the mic audio. <laughs> so I'm going to redo it. Um, go to, you're going to do Snowy Tundra Vault, and I would recommend changing it to Challenge 4. You get the most units per chest out of that. Um, I want to redo it mainly because you'll get the audio of what I'm saying, hopefully. And um, I want to show you that you can get all the chests with a non-flying character. I'm, <clears throat> so I'm going to use Black Widow. And this is best to do as long as your character is like 140 to 150. The level level doesn't make much difference, I don't think, as long as your power is pretty good. Uh, oh yeah, launch. <laughs> I always forget to hit launch. I'm an idiot. So, anyway, usually I do this with Thor and it goes a little bit faster because he can fly. But I'm hoping using Black Widow, I can show you uh, some more options of where things can be. And, um, I don't know what else. Just that I well at first I only was using Black Widow. I probably use her the most now to do this because she needs to level up more. But um, yeah, I really just started using her to see if you could get all the same chests you get with Thor with her. It takes a little bit longer because she can't fly, but we got it. Got my. Je ne connais pas l'emplacement exact de l'abri. Votre détecteur de signal devrait capter une fréquence du shield. Take off, take off to the right. Il suffit d'inspecter la zone devant vous. Okay. Remember, if you hit up arrow, you can see some stuff. That question mark that says 200 something away is where we're headed. That's our first stop. There's a silver chest in there, and you don't have to finish the vault. Actually, I recommend not finishing the vault if you want to farm units over and over again. Because if you finish the vault, then the snowy tundra vault will disappear, and you'll have to re-hunt down the vault coordinates. Um, when you do that. Hey, bitch. Turret your face off. All right, you don't actually have to fight anybody, but I like it. So... Ooh. Okay, and she won't auto do the turret. Take it in the face. This, oh shit, these are some guys. This building always has four switches, and sometimes they uh, Why am I not hitting this dude? There he goes. Sometimes they're the range switches, sometimes they're the melee switches, and sometimes they're the step switches. They, it's like we're step switches. I'm gonna let my team handle some of those guys. Okay, I'm gonna start on the back. There's four switches here, so I'm gonna run her around the backside. <laughs> backside attack. And there's one, and the other three are out front, which we probably noticed in before. Two. And I'm gonna do it over here. Three. And four. Black Widow is also pretty good for the melee target. No, the, the range targets. So there's that. 45 units. Okay. I should keep track here. So we started with 208 in here. I just want to note how many we ended up with. So 208 is our starting point. My three dudes. I'm just not going to fight off the rest of those guys. We're going to bounce our way over to the giant aim hexagon light up thingy doorway window thingy. Granted, okay, so this is probably not going to be an exhaustive. I mean, it's all the ones I've ever found. It doesn't mean that they're the ones that aren't here. All right, now this takes a little bit of finagling. You gotta get her up, and she always says that, which is weird. Up to the top. Okay, there's three options. It could be there, which it is. It could be right here, or it could be in this room in the corner. And this one's over here today. This is an orange, I guess it should be bronze. And if you always accept your faction assignments, you will get a fuck ton of polychrons while you do this. Especially if you decide you're gonna fight the guy, because you can get a lot of 
different kinds of enemies and a lot of your tasks done in the snowy tundra. I try to make a point of running two or three snowy tundras at a time. I think the last time I pay attention, you get like 600 units this way. There's a silver chest back here, so you can watch where I was going. Up the thingy and jump over. You can jump to this hexagon, which is fun. Pause. At that building across the way, there is another bronze chest. We'll go the long way around. Sometimes it's on this corner, which you can see from the hexagon platform. Sometimes it's right here, and sometimes it's right here. Bronze. And you know, fragments are useless, but that's okay. Well, they're useful, but you just have too fucking many of them. All right, here, okay. This is why it's better with a flyer, because it's faster. I'm just gonna bounce around these guys. Okay, I start at this platform over here. You can fight the big guy if you want. I'm gonna try not to die. That one, or this one, oh fuck. Or this one usually has one. There's two in this area by where the rescue person is, and they rotate where they are. Okay, so this one is here which if you go too fast, it's hidden by that snow mound. So, you know, it glows bright orange. It's hard to spot. There could also be one on this platform, which there's not. And there's another platform out here. This one, which, ooh, it has one, yeah. So usually there's two between those six spots. Uh, there's the free the dude thing, which I'm gonna do because sometimes that's the, I meant sometimes to free the dude from the box. Uh, turret, motherfucker. And she won't auto aim at the turret. So that would be nice. If they don't count as Ooh. All right. Now, if you look, where's this guy? Okay, so there's the little prison unit behind it and up. There's one there. There's also a bronze one near. I, think, I can't jump right there. Near it. Well, come on, donkey. There we go. Okay. Sometimes it's at the bottom of this pedestal. This pedestal is where the, this platform is where the silver one is. Oh shit. Okay. Sometimes there's a bronze one back there. Sometimes it's under this platform and sometimes it's very difficult to see, but it's over here in the bush. Then if you run off to the right, just kind of fall. If you're Thor, you can fly, or Iron Man, you can fly, and go up this little tiny crevasse. This one might not be worth it, but, you know, for completion. Ah, it's a fucking turrets. They're cunty. There's one bronze chest that just on that. It could either be here, or over here. More often than not, up here, I find it here. There's another place that looks exactly like this later that will have the same bronze chest in the same three spots. So, copy, paste, programming at its own. All right, now that's all for this little nook. And I have run through this little nook plenty of times. The vault actually could be down in this little nook. We're not going to do the vault. We're just going to bounce through our carnage. Try not to die when we hit the big guy and get some more chests on the other side. Then there's a more even pattern to the rest of this. Ooh, balls. Uh, some balls, there we go. That sounds bad, but you know what? Fuck it. I am bad. Okay. Nope. All right, cross the bridge. So you can swing on the thingies. Go up here, okay, now. There's one here. It's sometimes on this storage container, and it's sometimes at the bottom of this pillar. 
and sometimes it's over here, which is what it is today. Uh, and there's two, well actually there's two in this next part, we'll show you one at a time. This one, could be okay, it could be here, it could be there where it is, or it could be on that little storage thing to the left, it could be there. Oh, you fucking skittings. Then the second one is over here, and the second one could either be at the base of that tower, which it is, up on that platform, or in between, you can't see where I'm pointing, in between those two things on the ground. Today it's over here. All right, now we're gonna run to the left, left or right, yes. This building, which is also one that's marked, is a four switch building that has a gold chest inside. It also always has a DNA chest. I'm not opening DNA chest for the rest of the because I like her stuff and I don't want to use my DNA tokens on her. I'll do it later with another person. But, oh shit, you can't see. This one has four. Again, this can be melee targets or step targets or uh, range targets. The range targets are always in the same spot, so just two in the front and two in the back. I have time to hit you. And we're gonna fall down and go in the front. Get some useless fragments and a gold chest. Gold chest is good. More useless fragments. There's your DNA chest. Saving it for later. Get some balls, which I don't need. Alright, straight out of the doorway. Up here. There's usually one right here. And it's just like at that crease we went up before. It's usually here, but sometimes it's on the bottom of this platform, or sometimes it's over there. Sometimes it's here, and sometimes it's at the bottom of this platform. Okay, now we're going to go... Where are we going? Oh, we're going into the crease again. This looks like the crease in the other spot. I don't know why I'm saying crease. Crevice, crack, hole, entry point. Okay. This one has a silver chest up top, and, oh shit. The silver chest up top, which if you're flying, you can just fly up here, Black Widow, Hawkeye, and Kate Bishop will just like zip their way up here. Um, anybody else, you're gonna have to go up the sides, but either side will give you up here. Uh, there's a bronze chest somewhere. It is. Same three spots as the last crevice because it's the same little map piece. Alright. Let's pick up some balls here. Okay, now. Make your way to the left out of the crevice. And there's this building. This building has a single trigger. That if, it, if it's a melee target, it's right there. If it's a step target, it's on the Front. Ah, yeah. Okay, these is... I don't know why I'm not invisible more. It's so much easier. Silver chest. Shit. <laughs> Alright, there's not one. Oh, is there one? No, I don't think there's one up here. But I don't, I don't think I've ever found one here. Although it looks like the same place where you always find them over there. Okay, there's this building that we're going to do in a minute, but we're going to run right past it. There's its range target. It's a single shot building, so I'll just open it while we're talking about it. We're going to go out here. This building has an, a bronze chest, and it could be here. It's just like the one at the beginning of this map, or it's over here. Or it's right here. Okay, now I'm gonna double back. The nice thing about Thor is that he has area attacks, so you can kind of get rid of a bunch of these at once. He dubs doesn't really do that. But her high caliber is pretty high caliber. 
I'm talking too much and I'm not going to open it. Okay. I can't do that. I've already opened it. We're just going to run in here. Silver chest in here. Okay, I think we are... Yeah, we're on the downhill side now. Okay, there's not anything over here. I probably need to find it. I'm just going to circle through to make sure. I don't think I've ever seen anything up here. No. Okay. This tower has one at the top. It's marked on the map. It's a silver chest. There's a DNA chest in here somewhere too. And I zipped up past the green. I hope I don't die. This will help. Yeah, it took you down, motherfucker. All right. Oop. Sorry. I'm not carrying it up any of these. Oops. Stuff in here. Go up again. Silver chest right here. Oh, Ooh, my stomach is not happy with me. Bitch, don't hit me while I'm trying to open a fucking chest. You should know better than that. Treat a lady like a lady. <laughs> well, it's just garbage right now. Okay. Those guys are taking that. There was a DNA chest up there. Again, we're not getting it. Okay, I just jump out of that tower, run to the left. There's three spots we can look in between next to this tower and this weird little generator looking thing. Sometimes it's there. Sometimes it's here, which it is today. Sometimes it's up here on top of this platform, which I will show you. It is not right now, but it was down there. Okay, from here, you can shoot some turrets. I can also shoot you. I don't know why I'm doing this from here, but this turret is going to you up later. Alright, there's a chest on the stairway. Uh, Thor can just fly to the top. Iron Man 2. We can zip up a little bit here. Uh, we'll just run around. Definitely almost done with it here. All right. Silver chest. This chest hardly ever has units in it, but it has fun stuff sometimes. The nimble spark vest. There's a bronze chest at this top here, past that turret on the corner. Okay, now down here. One more bronze chest, and we're done. There's some turrets. Not to watch turrets over there. There's a fuck ton of turrets over here. There's one on the back side of this tower too. Okay, three possible. This platform. Okay. Down here on this, and you just saw it again. We're on this platform. And that'll be the end of this. Okay. I don't know why have units in it either. Okay, what did we do? We started with, what did I say, 208? 823, so a little bit more than 600 units. Okay. Um, now, if you want to finish and do the vault, follow the trail to the vault. If you want to keep farming units, get out of here, go back to the Quinjet, and do it again. You will have to tell it to be... What's the word I'm looking for? You'll have to tell it to be difficulty 4 again, but... That always happens. All right, catch you later.